Hey you guys, so welcome back to another video. Excuse the messy sweatshirt. I was <laughs> we're smack dab in the middle of like quarantine. So this is my jam right now. This is my life. I've got, I don't even know what on the collar. Okay, so welcome to this video. We're gonna chat all about blue light blocking glasses today. Okay, we're gonna talk about um why you might need them and why by the end of this video you're probably going to be going to the Amazon link and getting them and like how do you know which brands are good like what to look for in a blue light blocking glasses and um the couple of different brands that I got so the reason that I'm sharing this with you um so obviously you guys know I work from home um you know I teach the courses I have my online business and I've you know been doing this for quite some time and um so i'm on my computer a lot okay like a lot and sometimes i get migraines and i found that sometimes my migraines will be triggered the next day by the previous day really being on my phone a lot being on my laptop now is it only if you're on a laptop no where does blue light come from and what is blue light okay so blue light is actually, so as you guys know, sunlight is natural, <laughs> obviously. Blue light is the light that is emitted from electronic devices. So anything from like, you know, your TVs that we're watching, like the new, the you know, newer TVs, um, all of our devices that we have that are able to provide that. And honestly, I feel like the brighter and the more, you know, high def and stuff our screens get, the worse it actually gets for our eyes. Um, so your tablets, your phones, your, you know, televisions, your laptops, your computers, um, all of these are emitting blue light. Now, what does blue light do? So not only have they, they shown, um, and you can look up the studies if you go to Google, I'm not going to provide all the links, just go to Google, do your research and just type in like, what does blue blue light do? Like the blue light studies, they show that blue light can actually, um, if you have too much exposure of it, it can make you like irritated a little bit and kids behaviorally, they say that the blue light does that. Um, it also messes with your sleep cycle and your melatonin. So your, your body's natural circadian rhythm where it gets dark at night, we go to sleep, you know, the melatonin, our body produces that naturally. Blue light interferes with that heavily. Um, for a really long time, I was struggling with falling asleep at night. And I, I was like, duh, I couldn't figure it out. I'm taking, you know, my CBD melatonin capsules. I'm taking up my melatonin, my valerian root, my sleepy time tea. And like nothing is working. And I'm like, what the heck is going on? And then I find, I don't know why this didn't cross my brain, but late night work sessions. So anytime that you're on your phone, like past dark or a really long time in the day, that's actually going into your eye. There's these little like receiver parts in your eye that pick that light up and then they tell your brain like, hey, we're gonna keep going. It's not time to shut off yet. So too much blue light exposure can trigger migraines. It can cause insomnia. It messes with your body's natural rhythm. And not only that, but possibly the worst of all and the most kind of scariest thing that literally, as soon as I read that, I went on Amazon and I ordered our entire family blue light glasses because I've had blue light glasses. I've had the expensive brand and now we just ordered some from Amazon for everyone in the family. Um, but the the study that I just read was talking about and uh, gosh, it was like they it must have shown it to me as a recommended video because I was looking up blue light blocking glasses and whatever. So anyways, what they're seeing now is that teens and people in their early 20s especially are coming in and they're actually seeing eyesight and visual impairments and like issues with the the eyesight and the actual eye that they had previously only seen in people who were like elderly so it was actually accelerating the the degeneration of the eye and causing issues with the eyesight the eye the tit and I'm like oh my god you know because we, so for me, you know, I grew up in the 90s. We were outside. We weren't on devices. We, you know, I maybe had that little 
CD player, that little, you know, the Sony Walkmans. Yeah, like that was the extent of my electronic devices. And maybe when I was like 13 or 14, you know, we had a PlayStation. Well, now, even little, little kids, you know, you think, what do they do for babies? They give the baby a phone to keep the baby occupied. So kids that are like one, two, three, they're growing up being consistently exposed to all of this blue light. And we haven't really seen, we're just starting to see now the effects that that's having on the kids who have grown up with this technology on their eyesight. And it's not good news. So I went on, I purchased blue light blocking glasses. Now, when you're going to purchase blue light glasses, do you have to get the $100 a pair ones? Like, how do you know which blue light glasses to look for? So I did a bunch of research on it. As always, you guys know I'm a huge nerd and I love to do my research. <laughs> so this is what I found. I found that the, um, so first of all, um, if you, you can go to your eye doctor and you can have custom blue light glasses done. So you can actually have your personal glasses installed with blue light frames, okay? So that's something to consider if you have a little bit of extra money. Um, if you wanna do that, it makes it easier. The lenses, I think, are range from like 60 to 120, depending on your prescription. And now it could vary, but that's what I was quoted at. If you have contacts or if you don't have to wear glasses, you can pick up um, these blue light glasses, okay? Now, and these will actually block the blue light, okay? Um, you'll see that some of the earlier models that came out or versions had yellow lenses. Those are hideous. And so thankfully now that they've come out with these ones, and I don't know if I can even show you this. Um, I'll see if I can get my phone or something. But um, they've come out with these lenses where they're mostly clear, um, you can't really tell the difference, but they block the blue light. And you're looking for glasses that are going to be blocking at, I believe, the... Okay, um, you're going to be looking for glasses or blue light. Let's see here. Blue light blocking glasses that block at UV 400 or greater. So let me see here. So now I actually have a blue light tester. So blue light protect irradiate the white square below with the blue light ray generator okay so let's see here okay so this is blue light so i'm going to test these glasses here so this is the blue light that's being emitted behind the screen of your phone so let's go ahead and see what shows up and then i'm going to go ahead and test my amazon cheapy glasses okay all right so as you can see look at that so this is blue light right here, all right? Okay, so now these are my these are my Amazon glasses that I just picked up. Um, they are this brand, okay? So I have two types of glasses. I have an expensive pair. My expensive pair of blue light blocker glasses is from Diff Eyewear, okay? D-I-F-F -F Eyewear, I believe, or Diff Eyewear. I think that's what it is. They are made a lot better, <laughs> but what I'm gonna tell you is I'm about to test these out on them, on, on this, because I really, I will do a separate video on the expensive ones. You don't need the expensive ones. What I want to show you is that even if you just, you know, need an L cheapy knockoff brand, that the Amazon ones are going to do the trick. And I got two pairs for 15 bucks. Okay. So you don't have to go out and spend, uh, you know, a hundred dollars on blue light blocker grass, black, but <laughs> blue light blocker glasses. Okay. So now I'm going to go ahead and go like this. So I think this is how we do it. Is that right? Uh, it is, awesome. So I'm gonna go ahead and go like this so that you guys can see what I'm doing. Okay, so this is the blue light right here. So I've got the blue light and I'm just making a motion back and forth across the glasses. Okay, and look at that. So this blocks 100% of the blue light. These are just my Amazon cheapies. So I will go ahead and put the link down below to my Amazon shop. You can find them either in Sarah's Favorite Things. I believe I put them in that list. Um, and you can also find them in like the blogging and vlogging gear section. And there's like a work from home section. Um, the glasses that I ordered for my kids have not come in yet. Um, but the kids brands that I got, um, they're all inside of my kids list. So if you're like, holy crap, <laughs> I need blue light blocker glasses. Yeah, you do. And you don't need to spend, I think we got 
everyone in our family blue light blocker glasses for less than a hundred dollars and we have six people in our family okay so you don't need to go spend a hundred bucks a pair you can get you know for the entire family now that being said um if you do have a little extra money to spend and you want a little bit sturdier, a little bit more high quality, um, the Diff Eyewear ones are amazing. I don't know where I put mine. Um, so that was part of the reason why I got these. The Diff ones are they're just a little bit better. That's all I can say. So if you want a little bit more of a trendy glasses, you you know, you want to feel fancier, go ahead and get the Diff Eyewear brand. Otherwise, these ones will do the trick. Um, these are just my Amazon, these are the Amazon cheapies. So they are blocking the blue light. So even if I go like this, which I probably shouldn't do that, but even if I did do that, um, it's not going to get into my eye. So thanks so much for watching and letting me share the blue light blocker glasses. I found why we got them and hopefully you found this helpful and um, maybe that will help you a little bit. Like I said, when you're ordering the blue light blocker glasses, just make sure that they are blocking at the 400 plus level. So you'll be able to find that down below. You know what? And even if the frames are cheaper, as long as the lenses work, that is what matters. So thanks so much for watching, guys. I really love uh, making content here for you. I'm excited. If you have any kind of like requests for videos, go ahead and pop them down below. Uh, and if you're looking for more behind the scenes, I'm on Instagram stories on the daily. <laughs> so thank you so much for watching. All of my links and stuff will be down below. So if you want to check out the podcast, whatever else. And remember, if you are enjoying the content and you want to see more, be sure to click the little subscribe button and the bell so you can get notified when a new video drops. Thanks so much for being here. I hope you have a great rest of your day and I'll see you in the next video.